<laughs> Something blew up. Yeah, yep, it must have. That's a creeper hole right there. Yeah, it is. Hey, some clay. We need clay. Ooh. We're going to need clay. Lots of clay. Clay Aiken. Not uh, clay Aiken. Uh, no, not that clay. Uh, you, you might need clay Aiken. So how, how much wood do you want me to take back and not destroy? Well, just go look at the project table. I already have stuff in there. Okay, you to look at get a couple more wood while I'm here. It's they're stencils. That's what I wanted, stencils. Stencils. And that's how we make all the parts we need to make better tools. Perma tools that can be repaired without using an anvil. But yeah, to start smelting stuff, we need clay and sand to make grout. Oh, you've got stuff over here you're fighting, huh? Mm. All right, that's fine. Glad I could help. Okay, back in the house, Dad. I'm going. Let's see what Almost we got here. Almost daytime. Yay, daytime. Oh, I gotta eat. I'm starving. So, look at the project bench. You see what's in there? Something's sitting on top. It's called the blank pattern. Blank pattern. Blank yes, pattern. That's what okay. it's called? What do you know? See, I'm gonna grab a few of these. Okay, that's how you make the blank pattern. You see that? Now this right here is the stencil table. Hold on. Zombies, I'm trying to teach. Don't stop knocking on our door. Yeah, I did with my sword. Okay, so that's a stencil table. We can take the stencil table. All right. Okay, now look, I'm going to put it down over here. Where? Oh, turn around. Oh, I'm still on the project bench. Now get out of the project table. Okay. Hey, I'm going to take the blank patterns with me. Now over here to the stencil table. See, do, can you see what's in there? In the stencil yeah. table? Yeah. I have a blank pattern on the left and something shows up on the right. Do you see that? Oh, yeah. I do, yeah. Yeah, so that's a tool rod pattern. There okay. is. Okay, so I'll take one of those because we need it. Then we can just go next pattern. Okay, and see, yeah, there's see. a pickaxe head. And a shovel head. Axe head. See, these are all blank patterns, so we'll be able to do stuff with these. Okay. Cool. So, back over here. Uh, just give me one second. Make a crafting table with the tool station. See, I have a crafting table in the bottom. Blank pattern on top. We get the tool station. And again, that goes back here next to the stencil table. Keeping track of this yet? Yeah. Repair and modification. The main way to repair is change your tools. Place tool and tear on the left okay. to get started. Now with these, up in the upper left corner, you have things like a pickaxe and shovel and all that stuff. Mm. These tell you what parts you need in order to build that kind of tool. Got it? Diamond, coal, pickaxe. No, that tells you what parts you need. Now, do you have any raw wood left? Yes. Okay, I need some raw wood, please. <laughs> Where do you want it? In this table? Yes, please. So you don't ruin it all? So I don't ruin it all. Okay, so I have one raw wood there. Put a blank pattern on top, and there's a part builder. So back over here. Turn around again. Just put it down there. That's the part builder. So say we want to... Uh, let's get out some cobblestone here. Okay, I got a whole bunch of cobblestone. Now remember those patterns I made earlier? Yep. I put one on the left side, at the top. Okay. I put in the material I want to make it out of. Look at that. Stone sword blade. Stone sword blade? That's right, yes. Stone sword blade. Cool. See over there on the right hand side it has things like base durability, handle modifier, and all that stuff. Uh huh. So if I take that blade, there I go. I have a stone sword blade. I need a tool rod. I might as well get two of them. Okay. And I can get a wide guard pattern. And I'm going to make us two completely stone swords. Okay. Ah. Completely stone. stone. So no wood involved whatsoever in, the, in these. 
That's good, good or that's, that's bad? That's fine. So I'll do stone white guards. There we go. There we go. And I'll name the sword Burly Cutter for you. So I have a Burly Cutter. It's a broadsword, stone bound. And a Sova Cutter. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. So pick that up. That's called the Burly the Burly Cutter. See that? It's your own special sword. Ooh, the Burly Cutter. Hit me? Why are well, you? I was just hitting showing me? you. I was just showing you what you can do with it. Well, okay, I know how to work a sword. Here, I'll walk over and I'll smack you with it. <laughs> that? That what you okay. want? Ooh, look at that. Hold on, hold that. on. Now, back in the crafting area. Project bench or? The project bench. Yeah. I'm going to show you where we can put all the stencils that we've used. In a bench or in a chest, right? See, well, we have the chest, and now we have a pattern chest. Oh, I see. Okay, it's a special chest just for patterns. Where'd you put that? Right beside There we go. Look at all the patterns. So we can put patterns. We can put, uh, I think we can put blank patterns in there as well. No, nope, only use patterns. Great. Okay. Well, that can makes we me look put, like an ass. Can, oh, yeah. Can, can we, we put, put backpacks in there? No, nothing oh. else. Nothing else. So I'm going to start making a whole bunch of extra patterns. Because we need a lot of patterns in order to make things like bows, hammers, which are special tools, large blades with their special tools, excavators, scythes, broadhead axe, whatever that Scythes, is. You mean? Large plate. Oh, I see. Okay. So look, look, these see all these extra patterns in here now, in the pattern chest. Got them all. It's a whole bunch of them. And there's even more than that, too. Excavator. Would that be like a shovel? Excavator. Maybe. Maybe. I can't remember. What's fletching? Uh, that's what's needed to make a arrow. So when I'm making... Hammerhead. Yeah. They don't nail anything together in this. No, but you can use the hammer. It's kind of like a super-powered pickaxe. Oh, I see. Um, but it only goes through things like stone and ore. Oh, okay. So I'm I'm just going to have all the patterns ready here and put in there. Tough rod, tough binding. Holy crap, there's a lot of patterns. It's cool. I'm going to see if I have how many more patterns there are to make here. This is annoying. But yeah, you can make some pretty cool things in this using this yeah. type of thing. Oh, I already have the large plates. Okay. And so now, um, if you go come over here to the tool station. Okay. Yeah. See, you can make things like a battle sign. Which one are you in now? Which is the first one? Tool the station, one? the middle one. The middle one oh, is the tool station. Okay. So okay, so you've got like the frying pans, battle signs, chisels, short bows, arrows. I don't know where the hammer is. Why isn't there a hammer? There should be a hammer in there somewhere. Oh, maybe you can only use that with metal stuff. Anyways, so see how Chisel. I... Now, if you look in the part builder, which is right next to the pattern chest. Okay, look in the part builder. Yeah, part builder. You see all the patterns in there? Yeah. So we can make all of those patterns easily now. So um, if you want a fully stone pickaxe, okay... You look in the tool station, you see you need a pickaxe head, you need a tool binding, and you need a handle. So I'm going to throw you some cobblestone. You're going to make me do this now? Yep. Oh, this is going to be hard. So there's some cobblestone for you. I need, I need you to go it. to, which one do I have to go to first? You need to use the one? part builder, part builder first. Not the tool station. Nope, part builder first. And you Builder. need to make a pickaxe head. Okay, so you put in what you want in top or bottom, does it matter? Uh, in the top. Top left is the pattern. Top right is the material. This only works for uh, wood, stone, paper, and slimes. So what, are, what am I going to make? Pickaxe head, you said? 
Yeah, make a pickaxe head. Pattern there. And see, you have a stone pickaxe head there? Yeah. I'm going to take one. You can take one, too. Do you have one? Uh, I do now. Okay. Take so that now, pattern out. Yeah. And now you need okay. tool binding pattern. Tool binding. Tool binding. Tough binding pattern? No, not tough. Tool. Tough tool. Right there. above the tough. Yeah. See it. Tough. And now you can make one stone binding, and the stone shard you can replace in the with the cobblestone and make another stone binding. Okay, so if you move the stone shard over where the cobblestone is, there you go. Now I have a stone binding. All right, now. Now you put the cobblestone back. Where that pattern first? Yeah, and you, can, you need a tool rod. Tool, back, tool rod, tool rod. It's on tool. the top row. Second from the right. Now, there's a, I found a tool rod all okay. on my own. Now see, you can do the same thing with the stone shard too. So you take can move the, the stone shard over where the cobblestone is. Take the shard. And I'll take that stone tool rod. And we're back now. How do we put our tool together again? Now, in this part, the tool station. Tool station. Okay, so it's, in, it's the middle one. On tool station. You have to click on the pickaxe. And then you can just put your things in there. Each part in there. Each part in there in the right spot. And you can name your tool. This is the... Lucas is laughing in the background here because I said name your tool. What happened to my... I was typing. Well, you have to click in the box first. Did. Go ahead, call your tool whatever you like. Yep. How's that for a name? Nose picker. I just made it for you. Yeah, that's what I called it. All right. And then you take the tool. Right? Yep. And I just named it something else. Oh, I have burly pick. What do you have? Pick, that's what I called it. Oh, so we each have the burly pick. You call it. Now I can put put the tool back in there and rename it something. Uh, For some reason, it's called gold. (laughs) <laughs> it's not called a burly cutter, it's called a gold. Oh, well, it's fine.